Have we uh, greeted Box? Good morning, Box. I hope that you guys are having a good day and had a good New Year's. Um, we... you, you, didn't, you didn't ask them how they are. That's because that's what you do, Ken. I didn't want to take your thing. Okay. How are you guys today? Good. I'm glad to hear that you're doing well. If you're not doing well, I'm sorry to hear that. But I hope that this vlog cheers you up. Okay, Heidi. We've greeted the box properly Okay, now. I'm glad that box is at a proper greeting. Um, I am working on some laundry and washing all the di or the dishes. The right, sheets. Is that how you do laundry? Is that how you <laughs> do, how the I do the dishes? No <laughs> wonder I can never just do it, like, correctly. Yeah, no, I'm washing all the sheets um, from the beds we were staying on. And we're going to pack up and try and get to Tucson. It is currently... It's like, January 1st. And it's like 11.45. Noon. Yeah. So I predict that we'll be out of here by 7 p.m. Uh, no, Heidi, don't be ridiculous. Probably closer to th two or three. Hopefully. This is a bee. And this is inside our car. And it does not want to leave. <laughs> and I've been trying with the Tupperware container to get it to go. But, oh, oh, there we go. Come on. I'm going to try to get it out of there. That is a very angry bee. He's very unhappy. But I'm happy he's no longer in the car. All right, let's let him go far away from here. We are driving halfway to Tucson. That right there, Picacho Peak. Behold, Box. Everything the light touches is Picacho. What about that dark shadowy place? That is Tucson. You must never go there. <laughs> <laughs> I would argue that you probably shouldn't go to Picacho either. Oh my gosh, Ken, I am so excited to be on our way home. Yes, I mean, it was, it was lovely being at your parents' house. But there's just something about being in your own home where you're kind of just like, our I own, make the rules. Our <laughs> own little family unit. Yeah. Yeah, it was, I mean, my parents are great and it was lovely, but I've been gone for a month and I, I missed you so much for that first two weeks. And I'm just so glad to be heading back. I'm so glad to be heading back. Although I'm a little anxious because I know we kind of left things in disarray. I did my very best before we left because I don't know if you guys remember. Or if we even vlogged it. We didn't vlog about how late we were. Yeah, it, I it took me like an extra two hours because I was shutting the house like down and like making sure everything was like on lockdown so that it was even just unpacking the car is gonna be a, yeah. a fiasco so, though. I hope that I didn't miss anything important because like once we like we forgot to take the trash out. Yeah, or something like that, and, that and it was, was awful. Oh my gosh! So I think I got everything, like all the important stuff. Like all the perishables were thrown out, and like in the, from the fridge, nothing was in the sink, nothing was in the washer. I think I got all the trash cans, so I think I think we're okay. Good. I even opened up all of the mattress so I could like breathe while we we're there, since we're not even sleeping on it. Okay. All right. Look. Hey, look, we're home. We? We're home. We're home. Apollo. Go! Oh. Yay! Don't smash daddy! Okay. Yeah! Come here! I know what you want. Oh. Come here, come here. Wow. Hi, hey, what's in here? Wow. What's in here? Oh. Wow. What's this? Her name, Cuckoo Loka. Rosalind, you excited about your bed? Okay. Rosalind, what's wrong? You can't open these? Oh, what a shame. Yeah, these doors are harder to open than Gemma's. <laughs> Hello, Box. I am at Walmart. I am getting some, you know, essentials here like milk and eggs and whatnot because we don't have anything because I threw out anything that was perishable out, including mac and cheese. So I'm getting mac and cheese as well. I think I passed it though. I must have passed it. Um, and I'm also getting firewood because it's freezing in our house right now. Um, and what better time to build a fire except to give your heater a boost, especially when your heater is not that good to begin with. So we got this for Christmas. Boom. And I'm pretty sure that Heidi, who is cut up in bed because it's cold, is it super is excited. It is really cold in this house. I'm really excited. You excited about it? Yeah. I have to get out of the bed though. Yeah, okay, well, <laughs> that's that's going to be tricky, but I think I can manage. I couldn't find normal scissors, so we're just going to... There's some normal scissors in the bathroom. Okay, well, this is better. Little Cub misses her little nook. 
next to the refrigerator, so she's <laughs> decided to <laughs> make her own little nugget. It's not quite the same, is it, little cub? Yeah, you've got head exposure there. It's a tighter fit. Yeah, maybe find a different nook. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's push the drawer in and let's read our book, okay? Okay, can you say thumbs up? Sure. Can you say subscribe down below? Sure. And we'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Rosalyn. I couldn't help but notice that you still have your necklace on. Do we read, wear necklaces to bed? No, we don't wear necklaces to bed. Okay, can you take that off, please? Yeah. Off. Take the necklace off. Cut off. Yep, all the way. Cut off. Yep. It's, it needs to come off. All the way. All of it. Off. The whole thing. Okay, go put your necklace away. Thank you very much. Any other jewelry that, you, that I need to know of? The, yeah, the necklace on the floor. Okay, put that away too. Thank you. Okay. Good night. Will you throw the box night night? Night night. Okay. Will you blow him a kiss? More kiss. Go mwah. Okay. Bye bye.